Hi everyone, this is KG90W. I want to show you a quick project that uh, I've been working on. This is a DTMF decoder. A DTMF decoder that uh, runs a 4 relay board. And it gets the uh, DTMF codes from my amateur radio. So uh, here's how it's connected. Uh, the Arduino is connected to a DTMF decoder board. This decoder board is an MT8870. You can find these on eBay for uh, a couple bucks. They're just they're really cheap. And so it uh, allows uh, audio input through this uh, connector down here, or you can just bring it in through the pins. Whenever it detects a DTMF tone, it sets one of these four lines to either high or, or it sets it to low so that you can tell what digit was, was, uh, was pressed. So that connects into the Arduino onto some of the pins. And then the other thing I have connected to the Arduino is this uh, four relay board from SaneSmart. You can also find these on eBay relatively cheap. Uh, these are relays capable of uh, switching up to 10 amps at uh, 250 volts AC. So uh, pretty heavy duty uh, little, little devices to play with. And then uh, also connected to this whole thing is uh, a radio. And so I'm bringing the audio uh, out of the radio or audio into the DTMF board. It is uh, just receive audio coming out of a Motorola CDM1550. You could use a scanner. I just happen to have one of these laying around. So that's what I used. Um, so when the uh, system starts, uh, it'll tell you what the access code is. So currently I've got the access code set to one, two, three, four. So the way this works is you send the access code and then you send uh, another digit that says, hey, here's which relay I want to turn on. So in this case, my uh, I've got I've got the uh, uh, access code set to one, two, three, four. So we're going to do one, two, three, four. And then we're going to turn relay one on. And in case you didn't hear it, you can see that relay one turned on. After five seconds of not returning a code, it's going to ask, or it needs to hear the uh, uh, the passcode again in order to enter another code. So we'll enter the passcode again, and then we're going to turn on the rest of the relays. And so now all four relays are on. Wait five seconds, enter the passcode again and we can turn them off. And now all of them are turned back off. So pretty simple. Um, the uh, the way I did this is, if you look at your keypad, so relay one goes on, relay two, relay three, relay four, and then off is two, four, two, five, eight, and then six. So that's all included in the documentation as well. So uh, there'll be a link uh, to the website that gives you the code so you can look at the code. Uh, other thing that's kind of neat to, to do here is to set the passcode. So you're going to have to use one, two, three, four. If you take uh, pin seven to three volts when you boot this thing up, you're allowed to enter the passcode via the uh, serial monitor in the Arduino toolkit. Uh, one of the things I do want to add is the ability to send a CW back to the radio to provide some acknowledgement tones. Uh, also to be able to let you set the passcode using DTMF from your radio. But uh, here's a cool way for you to use an, uh, an MT8870 DTMF decoder board and uh, your relay board to create uh, some type of a control that you can use for turning radios on and off or you can use it to turn lights on and off or really anything else. Uh, it's really kind of fun to play with. So I hope you enjoyed this and uh, good luck with experimenting with your Arduino. 7-3 from KG9DW.